In the last lecture, I have discussed circle of curvature. In this lecture, I am going to discuss about evolutes. Locus of the center of curvature is called evolutes. Here in this GIF, evolute of parabola x square equals to 4ay has been shown. The blue curve is the parabola x square equals to 4ay and the red curve here is the evolute of the parabola x square equals to 4ay. The green line is the radius of curvature and the circular red curve is the circular curvature. Here you notice that the point on the circumference of the circular curvature is moving on the blue curve and the green line that is the radius of curvature is decreasing and then it is increasing and the center of curvature is producing a red curve which is called the evolute of the parabola x square equals to 4ay. Here is a question show that the evolute of the parabola y square equals to 4ax is 27a y square equals to 4x minus twice a whole cube. Look in the diagram the black curve is the parabola y square equals to 4ax and the red circular curve is the circle of curvature and the center of curvature also shown. We have to find this center of curvature for this parabola. As we know the parametric equation of parabola y square equals to 4ax is x equals to 80 square and y equals to twice 80. Using this parametric equations, we have to find the center of curvature for the parabola y square equals to 4ax. We know the formula for center of curvature x bar equals to x minus y1 1 plus y1 square by y2. Just we have to find y1 and y2 then put the values of y1 and y2 we will get 380 square plus 2a. Then we have to find y bar using the formula y minus 1 plus y1 square by y2 and we will get minus 280 q. If we eliminate t from these two equations then we will get the required evolute of parabola y square equals to 4ax. Let us eliminate t from these two equations. From the first equation 3a t square is x bar minus twice a t square is x bar minus twice a by 3 and t is x bar minus twice a by 3 power half. From the second equation t cube equals to minus y bar by twice a and t is minus y bar by twice a power one third. Now comparing these values x bar minus twice a by 3 power half equals to minus y bar by twice a power one third. Now if we take the power 6 both side then we will have this power 3 and minus y bar by twice a power square and which is y bar square by 4 a square. So we will have 27 y bar square equals to 4 a square x bar minus twice a whole cube. Now we can substitute x bar and y bar by x and y then we will have 27 y square equals to 4 a square into x minus twice a whole cube which is the required evolute of the parabola y square equals to 4 a x. Next question find the evolute of the ellipse x square by a square plus y square by b square equals to 1. In the GIF you see that the blue curve is the ellipse 
circular red curve is the circle of curvature the green line is the radius of curvature and the red curve made by the centers of curvature is the evolute of the ellipse we know the parametric equation of ellipse x equals to a cos t and y equals to b sin t and we have to find the center of curvature using this parametric equation and also the formula x bar equals to x minus y1 1 plus y1 square by y2 and y bar is y plus 1 plus y1 square by y2 so we have to find y1 and y2 first let us find dx dt that is minus a psi t and let us find dy dt that is b cos t now we can find dy dx by the chain rule that is dy dt into dt dx so we will have b cos t divided by minus a psi t which is minus b by a cos t or b cos t by a sin t now you can find d2y dx2 d2y dx2 is minus b by a to minus cos x square t dt dx so minus minus plus b by a cos x square t into dt dx is 1 by minus a psi t so we have minus b by a square 1 by psi q t now uh, put the values of dy dx and d2y dx2 in x bar and y bar we will get x bar equals to a square minus b square by a cos q t y bar equals to minus a square minus b square by b sin q t now we have to eliminate t from x bar and y bar we can eliminate in this way cos t equals to a x bar divided by a square minus b square power one third cos square t equals to a x bar by a square minus b square power two third sin t equals to similarly we can get b y bar a square minus b square power two third this minus will be plus due to the square now if we add these two then by the trigonometrical identity we will have one and we will get the required evolute of the ellipse next question is find the evolute of the asteroid x power 2 third plus y power 2 third equals to a power 2 third in this GIF, you see the blue curve is the asteroid and the red curve is evolute. The parametric equation of asteroid is x equals to a cos cube t, y equals to a sin cube t. This problem you work out yourself. Next lecture on surface area and volume of revolution. For admission and course related enquiry please visit college website http colon slash slash www.svist.org slash